as you can see here, he's cleaning out the um, cinder blocks, making sure all that stuff is out of there, so you can rinse it out and everything, so that way you can see, get an idea of what he be doing with these cinder blocks. So if you kill three birds and two stones, or however the saying is going, that's what he's doing, so he won't have to do it later. Do it at one time, do it right, get all the stuff out of there, then take it up front and rinse it out whenever you finish doing the job for the day. So that's what we're doing on that end, Lorenzo. This is Lorenzo getting the bricks up right here. And he's made his way down this way doing what he's doing and I'm gonna turn you around so that you have an idea of what he's done so far so that's what he's been working on as you can see the sun is just now starting to come up we've been out here for a little while um, early this morning the temperature is supposed to be up to 100 degrees today and it's already uh, at 80 already and it's now um, nine o'clock in the morning. Okay, so we've been out here for about a couple of hours. So, mm -mm. it's gonna be a hot one today, y'all. So in the meantime, as you can see, what the chickens have done, but what I've done, which I'm getting ready to show you, they were doing pretty good to this point right here. Let me show you. Right up in here. They were doing pretty good, y'all. They were doing really good. <laughs> they were doing pretty good until they heard me dumping over some pots over in the middle of the garden. And they shot over there. So I'm going to show you what they're doing now. But they were just about getting it cleared up on this side. So um, I'm going to show you what they're doing over there. And what I've done in these two hours before the sun started peeping. So we're gonna work some more and then we should come back out later this evening. So as I come over here, I told you I was gonna go in the middle of the garden and get all this stuff up. So I was able to push that tote and grab the grow bags and all the pots and all the fertilizers and all that good stuff and have them in those jugs. We're gonna throw all that away except for the containers and everything, just the jugs. So as we walk over, as I dumped all that stuff out, this is what I'm lacking right here. I dumped everything over this fence right here. And this is where they was at, scratching and everything from here. Here is Shiloh, and she's working her way back over this way. I don't make no sudden movements, but anyway. And then we have um, Tibbet. And Cinnamon is right behind her. She's going to be coming out here, too. She's right there at the gate. There she go. <laughs> and Sassy. And so they done made their way on out. But anyway, um, so I got... Uh, to pull up these PVC pipes and I'm gonna pull up this wood here and right here Sassy came right on over here y'all they ain't wasting no time but um, I'm gonna get this wood up here and I'm gonna get the wood up here and then um, I'll transport these cinder blocks since Lorenzo's on the other side over there and um, help him get them cinder blocks over here to where I'm standing at with the rest of this stuff. So that way we can get them up front and rinsed off. So right now, um, they're still over here scratching, but they will work their way back over to where they, was, where they were previously from the previous video. So yeah, but I got everything cleared and I got all the chairs and tables and all that and I'm going to show you what I did with those but I'm still getting all this stuff right here uh, cleaned up as well too so that's what we've been working on 
So as I come over here, everything that was over in the corner right here, I told you those pots. So I just took them, picked them all up, and mm, while he was over there playing, yeah, there's the star, y'all, Mickey. But as I was over here picking up those pots, remember I was telling you about all those pots had weeds in it. When I picked it up, this is what it looked like. I'm so glad I didn't have to do nothing. I just knew those pots had all those weeds in it. And so I'm going to go ahead and finish cleaning up this debris, debris over here, as you can see. And, um, and after I get that cleaned up and everything, like how I got it right here, because those pots didn't really just make a mess. It was just those weeds were in those pots. It makes a whole difference right there. So we're gonna, I probably have another spot for that, but for right now, that's where I got stuff at, from where the, the middle of the garden, where everything was. I just got it right there and tore it down that sink area. So we'll probably have another space for this. Probably throw that, um, you know, we just have another space for this. But right now this would do. And I took all those cinder blocks that was over there and put it right here and the well and the little table all that um, yeah so as you can see I got all that stuff up and I set it right there so now it's, it's clearing on out it's clearing on out and then um, I'm going to pull these center blocks here as you can see you can see it. It's just two or four. Yeah, there's two more over there. And the same over here. So as soon as I get this out of the way, then um, Renzo said he'll get his whip, his weed whacker, not his weed whacker, sling blade, and just kind of knock this down because that little thing you don't want. We don't want that to twine up in that blade. Because it's viney. This thing is really viney. So he, if he knocks this down, then it'll be easier to just rake it on up. And just bring it over here to this pile. So, um, yeah. Mickey's over in his little cage. He'll be moving over there to the other side after a while. But, um, yeah. So that's what's been going down. That's what we done accomplished in those two hours that we've been outside. Chickens have accomplished a lot. They're over there still cleaning. They're still cleaning, y'all. Still cleaning. And it's just looking, each day it's looking better and better. They done hit that middle. So this is the other side of that middle because the other side is cleared out. Now it's just this part right here that they need to knock out. They don't went all the way around it except for this side. So it's looking really good. As we come on over, it's looking really good. And then I'm going to uh, spray these down and all that, and that and spray those grow bags and have them in that place where I can just pick them up when it's time to go as well. So. I'm moving pretty quickly. I'm gonna put you up on this tripod so you can uh, see some of the things that we're doing this morning. And uh, and then we're gonna sign off for a little while. So, enjoy the ride.
So yeah, now that you've seen all the mess that I made, trying to get all those center blocks up, everything that's done over there, now I'm going to take the stuff that I have thrown over here that you have seen and make a home for it. Stack all those little miniature bricks up, all those things, stack them up, have everything in its place so it can be nice and neat. And now that the middle is done, just completely done, I'm just going to take those center blocks and have them over here on this side as well. That way that whole middle is now totally complete. The chickens can go over there as you see and scratch away and clean it up. And then they'll be working their way over there where Lorenzo was at earlier getting those cinder blocks. He's steady wheeling some out. He done grabbed some more. That sun was peeping right there in that corner. So he left that spot and went to another spot where I have helped him get some cinder blocks up. So. As you've seen in the previous videos, he was willing them, you know, the scraps and stuff that don't need over to the driveway on the other side of the house. And he's using those bricks to take up to the front to rinse off. So now I'm going to go ahead and start cleaning this stuff up. And, uh, yeah, we're almost done as far as what we need to do is getting all the debris and everything in the way. 
so that way you can get it cleaned up there's some more cinder blocks where i said the little fence was i'm gonna get them up too but for now i'm going to try to get the rest of these boards and stuff and everything cleaned up so i'm gonna quit talking and you're gonna see me do a little bit of that and then we're gonna sign off till tomorrow because y'all there's gonna be some more videos coming over to the other channel so stay tuned for that stay tuned for that and yeah so hold tight
It's still early. It's cool still. As you can see. <laughs> you say so. <laughs> He's got his baby. He done pulled it up from over there. And uh, is that for later? Yeah, gotta have something to cool me off. Oh, he's over here. As you seen, he was over here doing his little brick laying over here. Cause we get all this stuff up. You seen what I've done back there? We're gonna pull the rest of this watermelon up <laughs> and finish the rest. I show ages because a whole lot of them is growing, but I gotta get my yard back in. Okay? Yeah. I hope you're able to hear us because we didn't put the mics on because we're doing a lot of movement. We do not want to break that microphone. So he was just saying he hates to pull up all that stuff because it's still growing. But we're trying to get this yard back the way it was so we can get out there next year. And there'll be more watermelon than what we have. Antelope, honeydew, all the works. I'm just looking forward to it. I'm taking my blackberry bush with me. And the blackberries are going too, y'all. But uh, we're going to be working out here, doing the, as most as we can. It's going to get up to 100 degrees right now. It's, it's, it's pleasant right now. But we got up really early. And until the next video, be looking forward over there on the Blockett Family Homestead. Down below, there'll be a a link to go to that channel, go ahead and give it a thumbs up, subscribe over there as well. Leave some comments as well. Um, we're going to do some vlogging over there. And uh, the center block that you're saying, that's probably a one fourth of it. Yeah. I got a whole lot more to go. They need to stay out of the way. I got to pick them up and do like I just did. Get them out here. In the driveway, when that time comes, all I gotta do is load them up. That's right. All we have to do is load things up. We're putting everything in its place so that way we can load it up next year, the Lord's will. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment down below. Make sure y'all ring that bell, that notification bell. That way you'll know whenever upload we got is coming to you, okay? And y'all, have yourself a wonderful. Bless that. Bye-bye.